So I got my things taken in Cali, Colombia. I should have been smarter, but I just, they got me. Here's my story. Today, we went downtown. Just a normal day, although I have to say it was a bit busier than normal. We were just walking through the streets, all was well until I'm suddenly feeling the pressure on my back and I look over my shoulder and I see two guys following closely behind me so i look back again and i see that my bag is halfway unzipped and i know that maybe five minutes before i just made a purchase so i put my wallet in my bag zipped it up and put it on my back so i know that it was zipped before so I take my bag off, I look in the pocket, my wallet's gone. I'm thinking, okay, maybe I put it in the wrong or in a different compartment. So I'm searching through my bag, it's gone. My phone is still there, thank God. My phone was still there, but like a few seconds later, it could have been gone as well. I just so happened to feel some pressure on my back, I guess, from them unzipping it or like placing their hand down in there. I just felt it. And so I was just at least partially relieved that my phone was still there, but my wallet was gone. So I stopped and I was like, said something to the, to the guy. And I'm like, really? You know, my mistake, you know, my English was the first thing that came out i'm not gonna lie to you and then i'm like okay okay like i need to say something to this guy in his language right so i just asked him i was like you know what look this is beyond you taking my money you know what i mean i'm just like mi tarjeta de identificación por favor you know like i just want my schedule at least you know i just want my id please because it's just a pain to have to go through that process again to try to get another one so I'm like, you know, just give me my card. You know what I mean? Like, you can keep the money, whatever. He He's just, he's just acting innocent, right? And so long story short, they send us off and claiming that it was a female. Um, after we asked, you know, I asked him, like, did you see anything? You know, what did you see since you were walking so closely behind me? Did you see anything? He points, you know, in this other direction. He says it was a female wearing, I think he said, a yellow top, blue pants. We go in that direction. And, of course, we didn't find the girl because we after thought about it. It was just a distraction, likely just a distraction to get us farther away from him so he could go the other way and pass off, or he probably already passed off my belongings. I didn't want to join this group of people who got got, but I got got. My stuff is gone. So yeah, I'm working to get my stuff back. And um, yeah, I just want to say it can't happen to you. And I do realize I made some mistakes. I do realize I should have been smarter. For number one, I mean, the very least you can do, which people tell us all the time, keep your backpack in front. Wear your backpack in front of you. You can see everything. If anyone, you know, it's very, very likely someone's going to try to rob you when your things are in front of you. If you're going to have your things on your person, your pocket is better than your book bag if you're wearing it in the back. So for some reason, you can't wear your book bag in your front, then put it in your pocket. Put it in your front pocket. If you have tight pants on, it's likely that you'll notice if anything touches you or if that object shifts at all. So keep it in your front pocket and have some kind of shirt kind of concealing that pocket so people won't notice. Don't travel with all of your cards. 
So if you're going to take a card, maybe like a bank card or a credit card, pick one. Don't take them all because if your wallet is taken, all those cards are gone now. Take a limited amount of cash. Maybe put it a, some cash in your shoe, put some cash in a like deeper pocket, and somewhere that you can get to it if your wallet is taken. So some cash outside of your actual wallet. Yeah, just be aware. And it was so busy this day, like, I should have known better. It really is my fault, like, I really can't blame anybody else. I just, hopefully he needed it that bad. You know, and luckily, I mean, things that were taken were replaceable. You know, it's not like I got hurt or my life was taken or anything. So that's good, but just annoying, annoying. And I was like, do I look more like a foreigner? Like, did I carry myself like I had, you know, more than others, you know? You know, with the bling, maybe, or like a nice watch, or really nice clothes, or, you know, anything like this. And now, like, just regular t-shirt jeans, you know what I mean? Uh, I have this watch I do wear, but it's very, like, just like a cheaper watch. It's nothing really fancy. A legit question now may be, do I feel less safe here? And I thought about this, but I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say no, because... I mean, it wasn't violent, you know, the people weren't violent at all. I didn't feel like I was in danger in any way. I just felt kind of annoyed. I just didn't feel like I was going to be hurt in any ways. In addition to that, I mean, you hear it all the time, you know, don't know that papaya, you know, don't, don't put yourself out there like that. So I've also heard about instances where people have been pickpocketed and, you know, their stuff has been taken. So... It's kind of not to be expected, but it's just a very common thing that happens. I don't say that I feel less safe here. Um, I think I just have to change it up, you know, actually not walk around like, oh, it will happen to me kind of mentality that we do sometimes. But uh, yeah, I see Cali as just, you know, it's the same place. It's not perfect, it has its flaws and I just have to be better about it. You know, it is downtown, it is a crowded area, people bump into you all the time, going down the streets, on the sidewalks, you know, you're weaving around different things and people, so, I mean, it happens a lot, and people go down there seeking just to do this, so, yeah, unfortunately. Was that, count? does that count as da, no da papaya, or, you know, does that count? Did I, did I? Did I put myself out there? Hmm, let me know if I did. Did I put myself out there? You know, how much? You know, how dumb was I? You know? Oh my gosh. So be careful, y'all. And don't be like me. Don't. So I just wanted to um, let you know about that. And put my little warning out there it just gives you a little bit more warning to uh make better decisions take care guys see you in the next one